Hey guys, so just showing a quick demonstration on how to share a wired connection via hotspot with an Android phone. So this is very useful, uh, especially when you're traveling. So I'm actually traveling right now, I'm in a hotel, and normally hotel Wi-Fi is pretty good, uh, but usually they give you a wired connection as well. So over here there's an ethernet port, and most hotels actually give you a ethernet cable. Um, so I've brought my own because that's what I do. So what you need is a USB-C to ethernet adapter, and then any you know normal Android phone. So this is a Pixel 2 XL, and I have a Nexus 6P here. So what I want to do now is, I'm just going to do a quick speed test on the hotel Wi-Fi. So this is connected to the hotel Cozy Wi-Fi there. Just to show that the difference between a, a wired connection and a hotel Wi-Fi connection. So that's running. So while, while it's doing that, I'm going to grab a ethernet cable. So I like to bring my own ethernet cable sometimes. Uh, some hotels don't give you one, so it's good to carry one anyway. So that's doing a download test, so about 36 and about 40-ish. So it looks like they may have capped the clients, the wireless clients, to about 40 megabits up and down. So what we're going to do now while that's done, so that's about 36 and 44, we're going to connect the USB-C to Ethernet adapter. So this is a gigabit adapter, so we should be able to achieve pretty high speeds with this. Just going to plug that in. Okay, so that's plugged in now. I now have to connect the cable to the port down here. Okay, and then the other end to the desk port. Right, so just to show you that that is in fact the same cable. The lights start blinking here, and then on the Pixel 2, you see that there is now these, this dual arrow symbol up there, right? And then the Wi-Fi has actually been disabled. So if you check here, there's a little cross. So what we'll do now is, I'll just do a speed test on this, right? So in fact, I'll disable the Wi-Fi. So Wi-Fi is now off. We're using entirely the wired connection. Right, let's just see what happens. Right, so we're getting about 90-ish. So it's probably 100 megabits down and 100 megabits up. So they've probably limited that as well for each client, just for some quality of service for everyone in the hotel. So what we're going to do now is, I am going to share this Ethernet connection with the Nexus 6P and we'll see the, the speed on this phone. So let's go here and go to the hotspot options. So the hotspot name is DSTM. I'm just going to turn that on. Oops. Okay, hotspot is active, DSTM. So we're going to go back to the 6P. Go to the Wi-Fi settings. All right, there it is. It's already been saved, so we're just going to connect to it. Right, it's connected. So we're no longer on the hotel Wi-Fi. We're now using the hotspot from this phone, and it's sharing this wide connection. So I don't actually have data right now, so this is a not a local sim, so it's gone roaming, so it has no, no data, so it's using entirely the wide connection and it's sharing that. So we're going to go back to the speed test, we're going to go again. So straight away you can see that it's, it's kind of doubled, so it's gone to about 60-ish probably won't reach 70 so it's lost a little speed because it's using Wi-Fi but it's it's double what it was before so as you can see you can share a wide connection via hotspot on Android and it's very useful when you're in a hotel especially if they have poor Wi-Fi not not so much the case in this hotel Wi-Fi is pretty good but the wide connection is better anyway thanks for watching